Okay. Let's play some Clock Tower. Going in totally blind on this game. I've seen a little bit about it um, on, like, general YouTube videos. That's about it. I played Clock Tower 3 100 years ago when it was a new release on the PlayStation 2. I didn't beat it, but I, I rented it once, I believe. And that's pretty much my whole experience with this series. But I've been wanting to play them for a while, so I was glad this won the vote from chat. Hopefully the audio levels are good. Yo, what's up, Zance? Yo, yo, fantastic game. Love this. And to Ghost Head is awful. So good luck when you get to that. We'll see. I don't know how long these games are. I don't know anything uh, about that. I don't know if it's realistic to play through all of them in October or not. But it goes this one and then two and then Ghost Head and then three, right? And that's, there's four Clock Tower games. And then I think some people consider Haunting Grounds kind of unofficially Clock Tower 4 because apparently they're very similar. I think that's my understanding. They're short. Yeah, I saw, I saw, I played this just enough to make sure it was working with the emulator. Like, I literally just watched the opening cutscene yesterday. And I saw this ending list. Apparently there's, what, four, eight endings? That's a lot of endings. I don't know if I'm going to get all eight endings, but I, I am playing blind. Um, maybe after I get a few endings, I'll use a guide if there's, like, a true ending I want to get. I'm not sure. But I'm excited. I'm ready to jump in. Raised in the Granite Orphanage, Jennifer and her friends were wanted as adopted daughters. Uh, how's the uh, audio levels, Zance? It happened in September. There's an ending that is canon since it's referenced in the beginning of Clock Tower 2. Very cool. Audio's good, thanks. Is that ending H? Ending A? Do you remember? Like, I would assume the first or the last would be canon. The first one. All right. Laura, hurry up. We want to be there before sunset. Miss Mary? Yes. From now on, what kind of place will we be living in? That's the fifth time you asked. Jeez. Don't worry. It's a very nice place. How dare you want to know about the place you'll be living? We're almost there. See? You got your own stream to do? Good luck with Clock Tower. Save often. Will do, Zance. Thank you. And good luck on your stream. Well, we're staying at the Raccoon City Mansion or what? What a huge place. Yeah. Main hall's gigantic. I gotta go get Mr. Barrows. Everyone wait here. I love this art style. This is awesome. This, this is such a good looking game. Whoop. And here we are, a point-and-click game, played on a controller. A little awkward. Uh, he said... Oh. Um... What did I do? I, like, locked my... Am I frozen? I locked my arrow in place. I don't... I don't know why that happened. I don't know if the game froze or what. Oh, now it's moving. That was odd. Hopefully that doesn't happen again. Okay, so I'm her. Oh, oh! I can make myself move by holding X or pressing X makes me walk where I pointed very slowly. Where are you going, woman? I did not click that far. Okay, I, so I can change trajectory mid-walk. 
So does clicking just make me walk in a direction until I tell her to stop? Yeah, okay. So I can tell her to stop. Can I go back? Am I on three dimensions here or only two? Looks like only two dimensions, left and right. Okay. Oh, I can walk automatically with the bumpers. Okay, so I don't have to click where I want to walk. I can just hit the bumpers to go left or right. That's pretty handy. And here we are. Talk to her, I'm guessing. Hey, Anne. You want to know what kind of guy Mr. Barrows is, right? Yeah. That's our whole conversation. Okay. <laughs> is that it? And. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Can I walk away mid conversation? I cannot. I have to let her finish. Okay, so it doesn't look like they repeat if you talk to them multiple times. Like, like they have one thing to say. Do what she has to say. What is it? Is something wrong? This house makes me uneasy. Yeah, I mean, it's a pretty creepy house. I don't blame you. And who are you? Uh, stop walking. Talk to this person. I doubt I'll ever get used to this place. Eh. Lots paranoid. So we are orphans. We live in an orphanage together, and apparently we've all been adopted at the same time by some rich people we've never met. They just decided to adopt four orphans. Who appear, I don't know, are maybe teenage-ish orphans? They're not little kids. Seems like this is as fast as I can move. I look at anything in the background. I think all I can do is talk to people and walk at the moment, at least. I, I can't like observe paintings or anything. Go through this door. Okay, so do I click on it? Seems I can't go through the door. How do I go upstairs, I want? Click on the stairs? Nope, that turned her back the other way. Can I, like, click on the foot of the stairs? How do you go upstairs? There has to be a way. Go back this way again. Don't worry, you got it. Yo, what's going on, Pat Mario? How you doing today? Didn't you vote for this? Hmm? Locked. Okay, we can't go out that way. Yeah, but I didn't know any of the games. You don't even know, you didn't know what Silent Hill was? I'm trying combinations of buttons now to see if it changes what anything does. I feel like there's got to be a way to go towards the back. Doesn't look like it. Looks like just right and left. Either way, I'm not mad. I'm excited to play this game, so... Do you have anything new to say yet, or same stuff still? Hey, can you go find Miss Mary? Oh, I can click on the table. Hmm, a table. That's it? <laughs> she does nothing at the table, okay. 
What happened to Miss Mary? Did you see the beginning, Fat Mario, or do you need me to tell you what you missed? You didn't miss very much if you missed the beginning. It's like a 20 second cutscene. Mary, she's taking a long time. Should I go find Miss Mary? No. I'll go look for her. Ooh, music! We got creepy music. Is this where I came from? I think that... Okay, so yeah. What the... The main hall? That was fast. What the heck? I was gone for 10 seconds. Girls? Come on, this isn't funny. Oh, I can run. I can run now. Now I can go upstairs. All right, I don't know if you were stuck in an ad break there. I left the room for literally five seconds. We heard a scream in the room, and when I went back in, the lights were off and everyone's missing. It happened real fast. And now I'm very slowly looking for my friends. Can I go this way? No. Yeah, we can't go that way, apparently. Ah, okay, so double click runs. Or the bumper runs. Ooh, jeez, hello. Hmm, I'm beginning to think this is not a very nice place. The other side's too far away. Okay, so we gotta find a something to let us cross, like maybe a 2x4 or something. So, uh, Zance was in here for a moment at the beginning of the stream. He's apparently played this before. He said, uh, it's a very short game. There's a lot of endings, but there is a canon ending. So I'll probably try to get a few endings, and I want to make sure I get the canon ending before moving on to the sequel. If I like the game it up, maybe I'll go for all the endings, I don't know. He also said to save often. I should actually figure out how to save. I don't seem to have a menu. Oh, but I can pause the game. Okay. I don't know if there's an... I, like, I don't use save states. I don't know if there's an actual... save system in this game or not. Hey, we got lights. Is it still locked? So if you run, you can't see ahead of you. Interesting, or at least not as well. Well, we can't get to wherever the girls went. Let's go explore, I guess. Why am I um, yellow? I was not, is that because the room is light? I wasn't yellow before. No. Does that mean I'm tired because I was running too much? Do I have to stand still or what? Does that stop being yellow? I don't know any of the mechanics in this game. Let's figure them all out. Can I not go through this door again? Went through it before. There we are. Okay. So what is what is this? Okay. A 
little hole here. There's a deep crack in the wall. It's crumbling. Go through it. I guess we can't go through it. Maybe we have to find something to hit it with. I don't know. I don't know how adventure game logic y this is. Hopefully it's not too severe. Like a lot of adventure games, I don't think they're realistic to solve on your own at all. You have to look stuff up. There's a courtyard outside. This game is a very spooky atmosphere. I'm impressed. This is like a Super Nintendo game. I love the art style. Ooh, the lights are out. Where's the switch? This looks like a switch. Hey. I'm good at this game. Got a box up here we can interact with. What's that? Empty. Well, that was fun. The painting. Oh, she has no comment. She's not a fan. TV? Maybe we can just watch some TV. Looks like it's broken. Or just mess with the antenna a bit, girl. She must be a millennial. Doesn't know how to use antennas. Okay, can I like can I sit? A comfortable sofa. Have a little sit. It's completely dark outside. What time is it now? I don't think it's time to get a watch. bedroom what we got here the green thing what is this thing looks like a picture frame huh. oh what the ah! did I just die what I just die from looking at a mirror? Is this game serious right now? Is it, that doesn't even count as an ending, does it? No. That's just a dead end. I should not have looked in that mirror. Um... Well, now anyone that missed the beginning can see it. And I'm going to check if there's any mechanics that I'm not understanding in this game. I'm not going to look anything up about the game. I'll just make sure there's not mechanics that I'm unaware of. Because I don't know. If there was a way to survive that, I don't know about it. Here we are, playing the game. Ah, there's a panic button that you're supposed to use to get out of dangerous situations, the B button. So I probably was supposed to hit the B button when I when the mirror grabbed me. I'm glad I checked. There's an item button, which is A. 
use to observe and go through your inventory. So A. Uh, X makes you stop running or walking. Okay, tap the panic button rapidly to escape. Okay, so I need to hit the B button rapidly when crap like that happens. Now we know. Glad I looked that up. Uh, I'm not using an actual SNES controller. Which one is the B button? Here it is. Check. The B button is... Uh... I believe the A button on my Okay. All right. Talk to everybody. This makes me uneasy. Lot's paranoid. Nothing's gonna happen, Lot, you idiot. Okay, so I can't leave until I go check and find out the other door's locked, apparently. I wonder if there's a way to speed up the beginning of this, because it feels like I might die a lot. And I don't want to do, like, a five-minute opening every time. Well, let's be absolutely sure the B button is the button I think it is. Let me just... Uh, wait. Yes, okay. It's the A button for me. Locked. And we walk back the other way, and then we can leave. Talk to her. You want to talk to them? No, they're around too. Talk to her. Hey, can you go find Miss Mary? What happened? Miss Mary. Mary. It's taking a long time. Good. I go find Miss no. I'll go look. Aw, uh, yeah, that music cue is so good. This game is awesome music. <laughs> the main hall! Fastest kidnapping of all time. Girls? Come on, this isn't funny. I think she doesn't care about Lot, just the girls. Or is Lot supposed to be just kind of a tomboy? I assume that's a boy. Can I leave immediately, or do I have to go, like, explore this room? Can I just leave? I can. Sweet. All right, girls. Smell you later. I'm going straight back to that mirror to double check the panic button thing. I don't want to get further into the game and then get killed again and just from not knowing the controls. Sorry. 
Where's the switch? Right there. Straight to the mirror room. And I'm still blue. Or I turned yellow last time. I think that must have been from running. So it's probably not smart to run unless I need to. I save my running for when I'm in trouble. All right. We're slamming the B button when we touch the mirror. As soon as it gets crazy. Oh, it doesn't happen if you just touch. So do we have to use the mirror twice for that to happen? Or do you have to stay next to the mirror? Weird. Okay, so maybe it's a chance and it doesn't always happen. Huh. What is this thing? Come on, hand. I want to test my thing. Okay, you have to try to use it twice in a row. Ah, jamming the B button works. Okay. Okay. So when we're in trouble, jam the B button. Looks like the left bed isn't used. Looks like the left. Look, she got over that really fast. <laughs> She's like, hmm. The hand came out of here, tried to kill me. Hey, that bed doesn't look like it's used. What we got here? Does this thing I'll kill you? <laughs> Leave me alone, bird. What? What? What is happening? Look, get me out of here. Go. Wow, she's really getting messed up by that bird. All right. Sheesh. Okay, so she got yellowed by the bird. I don't. So I don't know. Does that mean I lost health? Comfortable sofa. Can I use the sofa or the table? Huh, okay. What, what the? Oh, if you don't press anything, she sits down. Will that make my energy come back? Let's let her sit for a second and see if I, the yellow goes away. Oh, it does. We're learning, okay. So blue is, we're, we're in a good spot again. Let's see if we can get past that bird. I want to check the other door. So just sit still and let her, let her relax for a minute. I get too exhausted. Dang bird, don't you ever get tired? Run through this room, forget this bird. Leave me alone now. Oh, we're in a new hallway. Oh man, that's gonna get confusing on the layout. Let's go this way. Wonder if this got me to the other end of the room I started in. Get this room. Oh, those two. Okay. No, so I just went to the next room down the hall and came out that door. Cool. Okay, I know where I am. That's not confusing. What was that sound? What's this spooky sound? What's happening? Oh, I don't like whatever this is.
I don't like this. Go this way. Um, 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 hide? Hide? Oh no! Oh jeez, I honestly did not expect that. La Laura? What the? No, don't like, do not like, don't like that. Lady, go through the door! What are you doing? Yikes! Run! Um, let's go up, right? Up? I don't know if up's the right move, that's what we're doing. Did I get away? You just have to run away? Okay, so we were on the first floor. We're seemingly on the second floor now, I'm guessing. Okay, so we, you can just run. That's not, why, why am I? Oh no, don't run this way. Crap. You can just walk, you don't have to run. Oh great, it's locked. Every door is suddenly locked. He'll never find me behind this box. What is going on here? Nothing here. Can I, I probably want to push that box. I don't understand if I'm being chased or not. It seems like no, but I'm still running everywhere instead of walking. Oh, B button, B button. Ah. <gasps> he was still chasing. Dang. Why is he? No, you leave. You. So as long as the music's intense, he's still technically chasing you. Broken tableware. Anything with this? A can of insecticide. Picked up some insecticide. Ah! Now I can see it. I have insecticide. I haven't seen any insects I'd need to use that on. Still, it's cool that I found something. Is there any benefit to turning lights on? Except like a sanity system or something? Switch is broken. Okay. Push this barrel, please. Yeah, push it. No. Really? Because, I mean, I would want to use the barrel to get to this thing, right? The box. Looks like a bird nest. Yeah, if I push this box, I could get it. Maybe I just knock it down with this stick. Take that, bird. Oh, no. <laughs> I have bad luck with birds. Mm. 
Wow. Do I need birdicide? How do I make that bird chill out? Wait. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe. Maybe the bird chases the murderer away if I attack, hit it while the murderer was behind me. I don't know. That seems far fetched. I think I have to get rid of that bird somehow. Check its nest. Guess I'm, all these doors are still locked. Yeah. Someone's calling a phone song. Hey, I told you that you didn't care. All right. Question mark. The door seems to be stuck. Swimming pool. Oh, a scream came from outside. Oh, no. Seems that the door's locked. All right. I still not go out? Maybe after that scream, the door's unstuck? Nope. Mega stuck. So I don't, I don't know if the attacks are, like, timed, like he's going to come after me every five minutes, or if it's when I go in certain areas or what. That door's locked. Kitchen. Gas tanks for paste. Frying pan. Something shiny here. Wow. Ew, it's bugs. Oh, I have insecticide. I have insecticide. How do I 
I use it? I don't know how to use it. <laughs> well, leave. Yikes. We gotta sit still for a second and uh, we're red. I don't know if that means I almost died to those bugs or what. I don't know how to use the insecticide there. That was very annoying. How long do you need before you sit down? Will you not sit down in hallways? Does it have to be like rooms? I'm gonna try the insecticide again. Wait, 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 wait. Cancel, cancel. Can I sit down in this room? Yes, okay, good. Sit down and get your energy or health back or whatever. Okay, orange. Come on. A little bit more. Yellow. Okay, cool. So you can heal all the way up. Just got to sit. Come on, turn blue. Little boy blue. There we go. Now we're ready to deal with these stupid bugs, maybe. All right, insecticide. If I don't use the insecticide on a bunch of insects, I don't know where you use Yes, spray the insecticide. I'm a genius. Die, bugs. A key is left behind. Pocketed the gold key. Dang, I'm good. Okay, but it's not showing as an item, so it must be used automatically. Cool. What's this, a calendar? A calendar. Today's date is marked. Yes, and what is today's? Some drinks are lined up here. A ham was put in here. I picked up some ham. Nice. I like where your head's at, girl. I'd pick that ham up too. You might get hungry while some crazy guy with giant scissors is trying to kill you. This is a key, a car key, pocketed the car key. Nice, I wonder where I use the car key. Hmm. The 
keys aren't here. Um, ham. Let's try the ham. Maybe that makes the car go. I can get out of here with this car. But the other. Oh, really? Well, we'll just remember this is here, I suppose. Check the trunk. What's up here? A nice place to eat some ham is up here, if you ask me. There's nothing up here. Well, good thing I came up here. Okay, so we got a key, so some locked door we can unlock now, but we saw a bunch of locked doors. Hopefully it's like a skeleton key type thing, we can open multiple doors. Be this one? Use the gold key, aw oh, yeah! Turn the lights on. There's a phone in here. I kept hearing a phone ring. Looks like a bureau. There's some women's clothes here. This one's different. Huh? Picked up a black robe. Phone. I'll get it. The phone line's been cut. What? I heard it ring. Oh. Well, how does it keep ringing? Various beverages. Comfortable couch. Seems to have been recently used. A recently, recently used wine glass. Some of the drink is still there. Interesting. The little scissor guy. Ooh, a silver key. Well, scissor guy likes to get his drink on. I'm getting my revenge for them killing all my friends by leaving the lights on in every room to run up their electric bill. That'll teach them. I wonder if I got the key to the, um, ah, oh, come on, quit toying with me. How does a phone with the line cut ring? Maybe I could unlock the room where I heard the scream over here. Courtyard, I think. Try it. We got a key. Stuck. Okay, it's stuck, not locked. What about this way? We need some WD. Maybe some ham will get it unstuck. Good old ham. Can I not go right here? Oh, whatever. Just slop some ham all around on that door. Get some ham grease on it.
All right, I guess we'll go up the stairs, see if the key works in any of those rooms. I like the pace of this game. When I need to cross a room or go up some stairs, I can catch up on some reading. Two birds with one stone. All right, I'm gonna start trying all the doors. Shut up, phone. Oh, use the silver key. Ooh. Wait, is there even... What? Books. Okay. Odd. Very odd. The mural covers the entire wall. Part of it's hidden behind that shelf. Shove the stupid shelf out of the way. Uh oh. I see. We need to use the green bottle of fire on the unicorn cow. All right. That is an odd mural. There. There's a note here. Time will cause adherence. The clock tower's clock stopped. Okay. Take the candle. So, I feel like I learned nothing from this room. This, just looking at the mural in general. Pick a ceremony. Is that room inside this house? Is that a, even a room? I guess it is. All right. All right, I don't... Hopefully that'll make sense later. What? Other door. Wait, have I already been in this room? Oh, yes, I have. This is where I hid from the mean old murder man. The bird was in here, right? Maybe the bird wants some ham? Polly want a ham? Uh, Alright, we will use a ham on the bird's nest. Looks like a bird's nest. Well, yeah. Okay, bird's nest, ham doesn't work. Let's smack it with a stick again. Maybe the bird left. I feel like there's a key in that nest. Okay, so the bird doesn't... Now the ham? Hello, bird. Would you like some ham in this box? No. I'm gonna use the ham. But how do I, uh... Be cool, bird. Oh, I can't pick the stick back up? It's like a bird net. That's it? All right. We'll come back. We need 
bird seed or bread or something to give that bird, I'm guessing. I don't think there was anything in here. Pretty sure there was. Check that door. Are there any doors to the right? I don't think there were, but let's double check while we're here. I'll just run for a minute. We are so slow. Oh, she's already yellow from that. Dang, girl. You're in worse shape than I am in real life. Well, there's plenty of other locked doors we've seen, but I have no confirmation that keys unlock multiple doors yet. Hopefully they do. We got ham and a black robe now. We didn't have those last time we were over here. Um, I've been in all these rooms. I don't remember what each of these rooms are. But we need to find somewhere where we can sit down for a second and get our stamina back. I also kind of want to go back to that bathroom that had my dead friend in it. Was it this room? Oh, she's gone. Siznax. I always thought that the main chick from this game looks like the girl from a Labyrinth featuring David Bowie from DMC. First of all, David Bowie's literally my favorite musician of all time. So nice. Uh, and yeah, Jennifer Connelly, I thought the same thing, and I bet that's no accident. I, I'm sure that she was modeled after Jennifer Connelly. Like, it's, it's uncanny. There's no way that's an accident. I agree with you. How you doing, Sysnex? I don't have to go right now. Peachy, good to hear. Have you played this game before? Because I'm, I'm going in blind. Oh, you got a little gig. I'm going in blind and I'm loving this game so far. It, ooh, there, oh, that's just lights. This game has an amazing atmosphere. You've watched a lot of videos on it. Yeah, I've seen something. Did John Tron do a video on this? I think I saw a John Tron video on this game. I think that's about everything I knew about it. And that would have been a while ago. Ew. Well, not going to wash my hands there. It's like using the bathroom at my brother's house. The switch is broken. Wash them in the loo. The loo? Are you British, Sysnax? Aww. Okay, good. Felt more rhymey. Fair enough. Oh no, not the bird room. Run! The bird's really mean. Oh wait, the bird leaves me alone now. All right, nothing here. So the bird no longer wants to kill me. I'm from up north. Canada? Or like the North Pole? Latvia, okay. That was my next guess. If it's not Canada, it must be Latvia. All right. Hmm. Well, they can I use this empty box? Yeah, obviously. <laughs> like, can I just take the box and put, we can put stuff in it, right? Like I can capture that bird in it maybe? Uh, 
Um, can't explore that. That just takes me back to the bird room. Okay. Where can I use ham? We're gonna figure out how to use the ham because I'm very intrigued by why I found and took ham. Can't wait to figure out where I use it. Did the main thread already show up? Yeah, this crazy dude with a uh, giant pair of scissors uh, chased me around a bit. I've only seen him once so far. And it was very scary. It legitimately spooked me. Even though I was aware there was a scissor man from the JonTron video I've seen. Oh, this. Missed that last time. Oh, I can climb this. Yeah, the Kills News game gives me real bad vibes, for sure. All right, I missed this when I was in this room before. A pile of trash wood. I pocketed a rock. Oh, that would have been nice to find before. Lattice is closed outside. Can I do anything with this? There's a deep crack in the wall. It's crumbling. Let's try putting some ham in the wall. Okay, she doesn't want to put ham in the wall. <laughs> to climb to the top. You can't take just any old rock. You got to take the time to make sure you got the right one. All right, so with this rock, maybe I use it to throw it at that bird's nest or at that bird. Uh, That might make sense. So I might want to head back there soon. But since I'm already on this side of the house, I'll check the rest of here. If I don't find anything, I'm going to assume I throw the rock at the bird. Uh, but we did find a new key, so it's worth checking this room again, potentially. I'm, the rock? Heck, maybe the rock's just a weapon. Maybe I chuck it at the scissor guy if he attacks me. I don't know. Dome the bird. Dome the bird. I'll try to dome the bird if I don't find anything else over here. That's the only thing I can think of to use the rock for so far. I mean, outside of the very obvious thing of, hey, there's a guy trying to kill me in this house and I'm locked in, let's literally just throw the rock through any of these windows and leave. Oh, that's not fair. I found car keys and a car, and she was like, well, I could leave, but then my friends would still be here. So we're a very heroic girl. We could have escaped and we chose not to. We came back in here. But I do got car keys. White people syndrome. They always want to die in horror movies for some reason. Uh, yeah, that's true. I'm not going to die. I mean, I did already die once, but it was because I didn't know the controls yet. <laughs> So there's a panic button, which doesn't explain this anywhere in the game, which that's kind of normal for these older games. You know, I'm not a young guy. I remember the days when you had to read game mechanics and controls in the ma uh, manual. So I'm sure that was all explained in the manual, which I didn't read because I don't have. I'm emulating this. But I know there was like a panic button you're supposed to jam on when something happens. So like the very first slightly dangerous thing that happened, I immediately died to because I didn't know what I was supposed to do. Now I know, but that's been my only death. Oh! The other side's too far away. We need like a two by four or something. All right, let's go dome the bird because I got no other ideas. When I was young, I never got manuals because they pretty much only sold pirated games here in the 90s and 2000s. Oh, it makes sense. Uh, yeah, here, you know, I'm, I'm not so old that I was like buying games myself in the 90s. I had to play through Need for Seed Most Wanted with no cutscenes or music. Ew. Uh, speaking of, uh, new Forza comes out. Like, super soon. I'm pretty pumped for that. I love Forza, speaking of racing games. Uh, I have Game Pass, so I'll definitely be playing Forza. Uh, but yeah, no, I, I was a little too young. So I was born in 89. So, you know, I was like 10 or younger in the 90s. We had games, but I honestly don't know. I don't have memory of buying them because I, I didn't buy them. 
but we owned some games. We owned Super Nintendo. When I was buying my own games, that was probably like PlayStation 1 was when I first started, and PlayStation 2 was when I was mostly doing it. 94 here? Yeah. Classic year, 94. All right. Dome and the bird. So I'm guessing, because I haven't seen the scissor guy in a while, and I've mostly been wandering around aimlessly, um, it must be scripted when he shows up. Because I think if he showed up, like, every X minutes or whatever, he probably would have showed up again by now. I think the first legit copy of the game I bought was Final Fantasy XI, but I never got to play it. That's literally my favorite game, Sysnax. What a coincidence. Well, it's tied for my favorite game. My favorite game is a three-way tie. Final Fantasy... Oh, not Final Fantasy XI. I'm sorry. I got confused for a moment. Final Fantasy IX is my favorite game. You think it's randomized when he shows up? Okay. For some reason, I thought Final Fantasy XI was nine for a second. I like Final Fantasy XI a lot, but I'm not the world's biggest MMO fan. Uh, but Final Fantasy XI is one of my favorite MMOs. I like it more than 14. No, don't go up the stairs. I didn't mean to click the stairs. Oh, geez. Three hours later. I did not mean to click the stairs. Eight's your favorite. Uh, eight's really good. That's, a, that's an interesting pick. I mean, I like the whole PS1 trilogy a lot. I've beaten them all multiple times. I've 100%ed I've all of them. It's just 8 is often... A lot of people hate Final Fantasy 8. I'm not one of them. I think it's great. But I wouldn't consider it, like, top 3 or 4. I really love the first disc of 8. The first disc? I don't think that it suffers after that. I think the whole game's pretty great. I like 8 a lot. I think the only real real legitimate gripe about 8 is the junctioning, the magic junctioning system, which I don't really have a problem with. I think it's fine. I never got to play further because my original copy didn't run past disc 1. That sucks. 8's a great game. I got on a PSP, it kept freezing on a boss fight in disc 2. Forgot you could play PS1 games on PSP. Never finished 8, you gotta go back and play it. Well, it's an amazing game. No, not that room, actually. That's not the room with the bird, is it? Don't like four... Oh, hello! Miss Mary! That was unexpected. Domer with the rock. Glad to see you safe, Jennifer. Mary, everyone, everyone... Everything's going to be just fine. What are you doing, you creep? I don't trust you. Love the voices. Well, drink this. Yeah, right. It'll calm you down. Don't drink it. Don't drink it. Huh? Oh, geez, that's the fastest acting trank of all how much did she give me enough to knock out a few elephants was that just pure tranquilizer and like she didn't even bother mixing it with anything just a glass of tranquilizer Ugh. where good question who are you oh hey who, who are you uh, hey, look, Fat Mario's in this game. Ugh, food. Oh, jeez, I'm not food. Stay away. Hi, food. Are you kidding me? I got eaten? I didn't even want to go in that room. I mean, ah, uh, just for going in the room? You're the girl who randomly took a drink that got eaten. I very much did not want to take that drink. I was not given a choice there. Oh, that, that grinds my gears. Definitely shouldn't have gone back in that room a second time. Oh, there's a quick start option. Thank goodness. Continue. I couldn't even find a way to save. What's continue do? 
Oh, so let's not talk to Fat Mario this time. Let's go look at the other thing instead. Love the old game design, lol. Where? So you can hit continue if you get a bad end, but I don't. I have a rock. We're gonna we're gonna uh, dome uh, Fat Mario and see if that helps. Smack him with the rock. Don't talk to him. Smack him. No, 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 no. Uh, uh, food. Run. Oh, we can run. We don't have to keep standing next to him. Okay, so. Ham. I have ham. What am I doing? Trying to use the rock. Why don't I use the ham? Here's your food, dude. Here. Um, who are you? Simon B Barrows. This man is Barrows? There's this thing on the floor here. You want to keep talking? <laughs> right now, it's watching you. Huh? Watching you cradle under the star. Cradle under the star? <laughs> All right, that is one creepy guy. You have a stalker. You have anything else to say? Uh, he's no longer looking at Jennifer. What the heck else is there to look at? Oh, that is a girl. I thought that was a dude. Jennifer, you're okay. Lot. Half a sec. I'll get you out. There we go. Now get out of here before Mary comes. Huh? Quickly. Wait, you haven't figured out Mary's bad yet? Jennifer. That guy's weird. We should lock him up too. <laughs> like, relock the door. What? what the? A voice is heard outside the shed. Now, isn't that a pity? It's Nancy Pelosi. Jennifer. Don't move a muscle. Grab the stick. Grab a weapon. I will punish you. Grab the stick. Give a bam. Take that. Grab the gun. Oh, or just leave. Okay, knowing there's a continue option is good to know. Am I? Can I? Oh, I can stop. Uh, why didn't she just smash her head? I don't know why she didn't take the keep hitting her with the stick until you knew she would never get up again and then take the gun and then find that, uh, find that other guy. Double tap. Can I? Let's go swimming. Just common sense. Heck yeah, it is. Oh, look, a hole. There's a deep crack in the wall. It's crumbling. Go through it. Can I go through it? Hit it with a rock? Ah, that's what the rock's for. We did it. Oh, and I kept the rock, too. Hey, we survived all that crap. I thought I was going to start the game over. Nice. I'm good at this game. Turns out Mary sucks. Now, where was I? I wanted to try to hit that bird with a rock. I still want to try that. Also, what happened to Lot or Lottie, however you pronounce it? I assumed she was going to be dead in the water, but I, I didn't find a way to search the water. Um, I don't think there's anything to do in this room. Did I gain anything from that? Like, I don't have any new items. 
Hmm. Maybe I should have gone back in there after I knocked her out. That's the parrot room. You know what? Since we're here, we might as well check it. Maybe something changed in there. Nope. Still just a stupid parrot flying around. Hey, maybe we should hit this dumb mirror with the rock. My hand came out of here and killed me earlier in my first playthrough. For the very first time I loaded up, that's my only deaths. Well, until that guy ate me. Smash the mirror! No, smash the mirror! Don't preen. What are you doing, dummy? Alright, she won't smash the mirror with the rock. Love the word preen. Did I use that properly? I wasn't sure. I think I did. It was preening, right? All right, here's the bathroom. Nothing in there. That's where Scissor Man first tried to kill me. He was in the bathtub. One or one of my dead friends, I think. I didn't see which girl it was. All right. I'm coming for you, bird. Birds usually do that, but if it's the context, yeah, that's what I thought. I did use it right then. Uh, okay, maybe that way. All right, I'm pretty sure the bird room is right over here. You smell the scissor man? Don't be like that. We don't want to have a run in with the scissor man. And I bet he smells terrible. Then again, he did take a bath. Literally saw him take a bath. That's where he was bathing when he tried to kill me. So he may smell good. Oh wait, this is the garage. I don't have a reason to go back in there. I mean, we can check it out, I guess. I don't think I have a reason to go back in there. Um, I have the car key still. I couldn't open the trunk. Where was the dang bird room? I missed it. I don't know where it was, I guess. Doesn't appear to be anything new in here. I believe I forgot which room had the bird in it. Oh, it's upstairs. I actually do remember where the bird is now. I know where the bird is. All right, it's not far. Birds up these stairs. Wait, let's go back in the room where uh, Miss Mary drugs me. There might be something new in there. Eh, can't check that. So this is where she got her drug from. Doesn't look like there's anything new in here. The phone's a liar that always rings, but you can't answer it. Oh, the phone line's been cut. But it rings. Ah. Alright, if we can't dome the bird, we're gonna have to go back uh and check check the area where that guy ate me before. You know what's ridiculous? When I complained that I didn't mean to go up those stairs and went back down them again, that was where I was supposed to be. I was supposed to be up these stairs. That was actually the right way to go. 
That's where the bird is. But it all worked out. We got that exciting scene uh, instead. I doubt the rock even works on the bird. I assume I'm wasting my time right now, but I'm curious. You never know in these adventure games. Although so far, no especially weird logic in this game. Everything's actually made sense. I think this one's still locked. For science, yes, this is an experiment. One set for mankind, one dome for birdkind. All right, it's not this door, but the next one? Maybe it's this one. I think it's the next one, though. Yeah. Oh, this is the silver key. What was in here again? Oh, this room. Yeah, I don't know what to do in this room. I could try hitting this with a rock. Worth trying to hit everything with a rock, I think. I did dig adventure game logic as a kid, especially in Monkey Island. You know, I love uh, the Gabriel Knight games. Um, I've never really dived into Monkey Island. But Gabriel Knight's my jam. Really love the first Gabriel Knight. I haven't, I beat Gabriel Knight 1. I played a lot of Gabriel Knight 2, but I haven't beaten it. All right, I think this is the bird room. All right, bird. The Deponia games were decent from our modern take. I am not familiar with those. First, we'll try the rock before we see the bird. Like this. And we'll try the rock after we see the bird. Looks like a bird's nest. Love there being a rope salesman that sold them as neckties. Uh, in Deponia? I don't know, I'll have to check that out sometime, because I like adventure games. It'd be fun to stream some. Poke, poke, hello, bird. Yeah, you think you're going to keep me from that nest? Well, let's see what you think of this rock. Wait, I can't even... Can't even, like... Oh, oh come on, throw the rock at him. Everybody wants you to do it. Give the people what they want. All right. The rock is not the solution to the bird problem. Uh, I I own actually a lot of adventure games that I have not yet played through. Um, I got a lot of them on um, oh what's it called the um, not Steam but like the Steam competitor like the good Steam competitor. It's, uh, but it's got a lot of older games. The CD Projekt one. No, not the Epics game, so I don't like that. GOG, yes! I bought a ton of adventure games on GOG. That's where I played the two Gabriel Knight games. And I own, like, Phantasmagoria 1 and 2. Yo, what's up, Frenchie? Maybe I missed something over there. Uh, and, it, like, several others. I have actually have a good amount of adventure games. If, if there was actually interest in seeing those streamed, I would love that, because... Too high to climb up? I already climbed it once, because I, I enjoy them. Okay, good. I can't push this. Frenchie, I'm doing great. This game is pretty darn fun so far. I'm a fan. There's a man with giant scissors trying to kill us. Hey, I found something. What we got? Maybe. Did I find something? They can make for fun streams? If there's interest, heck yeah. That'd be great. Because then, you know, we can also... Did you get anything? She just opened it and there was nothing in there? Uh, yeah, it might be less annoying to solve some of the problems if there was more brains working on an issue. Because I hate looking stuff up. That's my one problem with adventure games. Sometimes adventure game logic is so bad, and I really hate having to look stuff up. I like figuring stuff out on my own or with friends. Some rope. That should be useful. So that's the problem with adventure games. They always have insane adventure game logic, and you inevitably have to look stuff up unless you want to be playing it for, like, a year. All right. I doubt I can use the rope on the bird. I can't see how that could possibly happen. 
Well, she figured out how to push the other box. Can I push this box now? Maybe I have to wake the bird up, then I could push this box. Because it seems like I should just push the box, right? Doesn't that make way more sense than whatever she's doing? Can I not use this again? Oh, I think I have to look at the bird's nest before I can use the stick. Okay. So then I wake the bird up. And then I look at the box. I think inside. Yeah, I know. Like, what are you doing? Why are you walking over here? I don't know why she did that. It was odd. So if you just look at that box, she looks at it and then walks all the way back to the bird for some reason. All right. Well, we found rope. We found something new. Um, Maybe I have to be standing on the box. Can I? If I stop on the box, I can't stop on the box. All right. Let's leave this room. I don't think I can deal with the bird yet. I don't have whatever I need. anything in here a rope might help with not that i can think of seen any holes that i could there well in the very first room that part of the railing fell out down like i could maybe use a rope there but i don't like that would just get me back down to the first floor again that wouldn't get me to a new area There was a hole in the wall. Well, that's true. I can already go through that hole in the wall. Tried to use a rock. I successfully used a rock on it. I, I busted it wider, and then I can go through it now. Let's take our rope and go check. Go back to the area where that guy ate us. You missed that? No problem. Yeah, that, that hole is now a, a usable route for us. And in fact, that's where I'm headed right now. Maybe you can tie up the shotgun chick. Hey, that's actually good thinking. Miss Mary. Yeah, if she's still there. I'm guessing she just won't be there anymore. But if she is, we could try tying her up. No reason for ropes in either of these rooms. Not that I can think of. Is this the hole in the wall room? I think this is the hole in the wall room. I was wrong. No need for a rope in here. I'm starting to learn the layout of the house pretty well, but not perfect yet. Ah, this is the hole in the wall room. Okay. And then this will, and I wanted to ex check the pool out cause Lot or Lottie, I'm assuming maybe it's Lottie since it's a girl, L-O-T-T-E. -L -L I'm actually not familiar with that name at all. I don't think I've ever seen it before. I'm assuming it's Lottie. Like Lottie ran out here and then screamed. I'm assuming she's dead in the water. But I haven't seen a way where I can interact with the pool yet. Maybe I have to drain the pool somehow? Yeah, there's no way to interact with the pool. That's so odd. Whoa, why did I suddenly turn red? Why did that happen? I was blue. This isn't fair.
Can I go left? Oh, I can go further left. Maybe she's back here. There's stuff here. Oh, this is why that door was blocked earlier. Now I opened up a kind of a shortcut, I think. To the other side of the house. That's nice. Um, all right, being red is very bad. All right, so that's one more door we couldn't open now open. All right, so this is where we left Miss Mary with her shotgun that we chose not to take for whatever reason. Let's just leave the murderous woman with the gun and run away. She's gone. I think we all saw that coming. All right, we need to sit and get our sanity or health or stamina or whatever the color represents back. I think I can sit in this room. Come on, sit down. They're not in this room. Is this room too spooky? Guess I can't sit in this room. That sucks. That guy's still here? We did leave his cage wide open. It'd be weird if he stayed. What, you just like being a prisoner? He's no longer looking at Jennifer. So, there doesn't appear to be anything in here. I keep thinking this must be something, but whatever that is, the weird green spot, I, I can't interact with it, so I guess it's nothing. All right, so nothing in here. Might be a bird. Another bird! Can I take this stick? Nope. All right, let's head back to the room. We s the starting room. I'm at a bit of a loss for what to do at the moment. Look for anything I can interact with. Such a cool atmosphere. This game is like an old Super Nintendo game, and I swear the atmosphere is better than like 99% of modern games. We're going to go to a room that I know I can heal up my uh, stamina in. I'm assuming sanity. Let's call it sanity. The only room I know I can heal my sanity up in, the TV room. Some of these old games nailed atmosphere. Yes, and this one, the graphics, the music, the lack of music at for a lot of it. Because the music's really, really good in this game. And it stands out even more because most of the time there is no music. All right, I can relax in this room and get my sanity back. I don't know if it's specific rooms you can relax in, or maybe the lights have to be on. I'm not sure. I've used this room before. Why don't you kneel down? Maybe I have to be in the center of the room? Still don't... Oh, are you kidding me? Friggin' painting just started crying blood. I'm trying to get my sanity back, you know. That's not gonna help. Come on, sit down. Will it not work in this room anymore? I'm sure, I've done it in this room before.
All right, game's being a jerk. It's not working now. All right. Oh, dude, there's so many more creepy things happening now than there were before. Game's getting creepier. Okay, this room's nice and light. Like, can I stop and rest in this room? And also, what's this little thing? Come on, please sit down. Yes! Okay. Okay, we're gonna sit here for, like, one to two minutes. It's kind of slow. But this will get my sanity back. Yeah, there we're back to orange, then we gotta go through yellow and then blue. And I see yellow. Show me yellow. There we go. All right, one more. Or maybe that's like a greenish tint. I don't know. Next is blue. Come on. Don't you feel better now? You sat in this room? Hey, we're blue. We're good. What a mechanic. Yeah, I don't know what makes some rooms good and some rooms not good for that. I'll try this door. I'm positive this door will still be locked, but it's worth trying while we're here. And we're going up the stairs. Maybe that rope will let us cross the broken bridge area. I'm just having a sit for a minute in general. Yeah. Maybe I'll like Indiana Jones across that fallen part of the floor. I don't know. It's worth a shot. Tie the rope around the rock and then use it like a grappling hook. What the heck do I use the black robe for? I'm assuming that's a disguise. I don't know what else I'd use it for. The other side's too far away. What if I use a rope? I can't actually, like, target the little balcony spot for anything, so that's no good. Yeah, it looks like a no-go. I don't know how that would have worked anyway, but I was just kind of hoping... Or, you know, you set it up here so you can just rappel down or something. I don't know. The other side's too far away. What if we run? What if we sprint towards it and we do a leaping jump across? Wah! No, I cannot. Now we're yellow again already from running that far. It's tired so fast. All right, that puts a little bit of a damper in my plans. I don't know where to go now. Hmm. Rock. Uh, rope and robe.
I guess we got no choice but to just hit up every room on the way back across. Which isn't really that many rooms. Not a lot to work with, but maybe something changed somewhere. I mean, it's happened before, like, when I went back to that room, I'd already been to that room where Miss Mary then kidnapped me. All right, we gotta have another sit because she already got back to yellow from running three feet. There we are, back to blue. Let's maybe... There's like an invisible progress bar. Let's sit at blue for like 30 seconds. And then maybe we fill blue back up the top. I'm assuming blue is the best. I haven't actually waited to see if I can go above blue. Maybe I should give it like one minute to see if there's anything better than blue. I don't think there is though. So yeah, car key. I know where the car is to use it. Black robe, rock, rope. All right, doesn't look like there's anything better than blue. Think it would have hit by now? For like 10 more seconds. Yeah, blue's the best. Okay, let's go. I know I was literally just in here, but we're gonna go, maybe I climb the rock pile again. Maybe I can do something with the rope now. We have used this little slide. All right, it's a pile, just a pile of crap. Yeah, there were creepy eyes in this window last time. It's dark outside. All right, checking every room. That painting started crying last time. That was new. See if the TV does anything other than static now. Yeah, I've only seen the Scissor Man once. One time. The far door goes to the, the parrot room. There, There's a door on either side for the... First bird room. It's actually two birds in this game. First few rooms as we got. Two of them have birds. The other one's the room with the mirror where the arm came out and tried to kill me. We got this bird flying around. Oh, this picture might have changed. Yeah. Yo, what's up, Doobie? What is this thing? It is a Super Nintendo game. It is a bit old. It's been pretty fun so far, though. There's a man with giant scissors trying to kill us. And all our orphan friends are being murdered.
All right, now I think this is the bathroom where I found my first dead body, which then vanished. Maybe something's changed in here. I just walk around like it's normal. Well, if I run, I run out of stamina, and I need to be able to run in case the crazy scissor man comes after me again. Oh, no. I think that's scissor man. Or is that just dripping water? No, that's scissor man. Maybe? I don't... If he comes while I'm in here, am I just dead? That must be water dripping. Either way, I don't see anything new in here. It appears to be as always. We don't like that sink. Bad things happen if we use that sink. No, don't use the sink. Why are you going over there? I did not tell you to do that. The water's running. That's new. Wait, I don't think the water was running before. Maggots came out of that sink last time, right? Mess with everything that uses plumbing. See if anything happens. I don't have to go right now. This game is unrealistic. Women always have to go. Looks like the shower is working. I don't know. I can't do anything in here. The tower on now? Wasn't working before. It doesn't seem I can do anything in here. All right, let's go. Next. So good doobie. If you're wondering what's going on right now or kind of where we're at, we have car, car key, but we know where to use that. Then we have a black robe, a rock, and a rope. That's all of our items we have, and we don't know where to use any of them or where to go. That leads back to the outdoor pool area where we already checked recently. This is the room where Miss Mary kidnapped us. We'll check it again, because why not? Doesn't appear anything's changed in here. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, nothing's changed here. Shut up, phone. You're no, you're a liar, and I can't talk on you. This should be the kitchen, I think. There could be something new in the kitchen. We've been here in quite a while. Um. Lights on. Check everything. Maybe we can take like a pan. Gas tank. Eating utensils. I found a key in the fridge. Killed some bugs in there. Get a rock. We have a rock. Found some ham in here, but we already used our ham. Rock beats scissors. That is a good point. That's a very good point. Empty. That doesn't look empty. We have a different definition of empty. Some drinks are lined up here. All right. I can't interact with that fridge anymore. So nothing new in the kitchen. 
We're running out of rooms to check everything out in. Is there anything left other than the garage? Pretty sure this is the garage. Maybe there's something in there. Maybe we use the rope in the garage. I don't know what on. Climb the ladder again. Like, I don't see the purpose of this little platform at all, but maybe we use the rope here, I don't know, to go down. Hmm. Yeah, I don't, I don't have a clue. I checked every room. I don't have a clue what we're supposed to be doing right now. Mess with the car again. This is where I found the car key. I doubt there's anything else there. Nothing else is here. What if we just leave? What should I do? We can leave. Oh, or not. I'm confused. Wait, get back in. Can I move? Oh! Oh! Oh, I can leave! Ah, I can just leave! <laughs> okay. <laughs> we did it. I won. I beat the game. Something tells me that's not the canon ending of you literally just leave all of your friends to die. But it's an ending. We got actual credits this time. Hmm, so what was I missing? What was I supposed to do? Something super obscure, I bet. Maybe. I only ever even saw the Scissor Man once. I wonder if it will let me continue from right before I bailed, or if I have to do the quick start from the beginning now. I wouldn't mind doing the quick start, because if we're realistic to get basically back to where I was. You gotta go catch some Z's? Alright, I'll see you later. It's not a big deal if I start over. It'll take me ten minutes to basically collect the stuff I had, because I figured that stuff out already. It may not even take ten minutes. Still, I got an ending. It's one of eight. The game has eight endings. 
Although there could be secret endings on top of that or something. Pretty small team made this game. That was not a lot of people in the credits. And so Jennifer returns to the orphanage. She was discovered in her room three days later. Dead? Oh, I died? I got murdered in my orphanage? Wasn't even worth leaving all my friends to die. I still got got. All right. So we got... Oh, we got ending G. That was ending G. Cleared. Awesome. Okay, now what happens if I hit continue? Oh, I can pick off, pick up from here and just not leave. Nice. Okay. Well, let's not do that. So that's cool that it lets you do that. So it's worth potentially allowing yourself to do dumb things just to see what happens. You're not punished for losing lots of time or anything. I love that. Like when I was playing Ly Lies of P the other day, I got the bad ending. I have to replay the whole game now for the good ending. All right, let's mess with that phone again. I feel like that phone might be the key. Because when she looks at it, she's like, the line's been cut, but it rings. Maybe I have to click on it, like, right when it rings, because it only rings occasionally and just for, like, half a second. I'm going to wait for and try to catch it on a ring and collect it. Nope, she just says the phone line's been cut. How is the phone ringing? Try to use all our items. The black robe on that phone. Phone line's been cut. Smash the phone with a rock. No. Use a rope to repair the line. No, none of my items work. All right, so it's not, it's not the phone. Okay. Maybe I smash this statue with the rock? We gotta start being like, going all out and trying everything, trying all of our items on all the stuff. Even if it makes no sense. We're going to adventure game logic. Nope, she just dot dot dots it. Try the rope. Wrap a rope around the statue and pull it away from the wall. Nope. All right, so nothing in this room. I don't think I can. I can't interact with the wine glass or whatever. We got to turn the light off? Does that change anything? Doesn't appear to change anything. Everything acts the same with the lights off. I prefer lights on then. Okay. Not this room. Let's go. Let's go back to the weird room with the weird mural. I never found anything useful in that room. And it feels like I really should, since I had to get a key to go in there. And that's right upstairs. After that, I'll go back outside here. That'll be the next place I try. I don't think there's any doors to the right, but maybe I use my rope over there. You never know. We gotta try everything. Let's try going right real quick. I'm pretty sure there's nothing. Uh, yeah, nothing over here. Why is this whole? Why does this area even exist? Strange. I use a black robe on myself. 
No. Okay. Let's go. Let's run. Run, girl. How long can I run before I turn yellow? This door's locked, right? Seems the door is... There's a rope on it. Smash it with a rock. Nope. Okay. Worth shot. We definitely need a key for that door. Okay, this... What is this room again? Yeah, this is the mural room. This is what I came up here for. Okay, maybe I use the rope in here somehow? Like, pick this back up? No. Rock? No. Black robe. Do something with the chair? Use a robe on the chair. Rock on the chair. Rope on the chair. Hmm. She just dot dot dots it. There's an. Oh, I read this note already. Time will cause adherence. The clock tower's clock stopped. Yeah, that doesn't help me. Can't interact with the candle that I can see. Oh, the desk. Various chemicals are on the desk. Really? And I use the rope on them. Rock. Robe. No, I can't use anything on them. Oh, is this a rock on the mural? Maybe I can literally, like, break the wall that the mural's on. That's something I could try. Nope. There's no way to use a rope on that. If I use the rock on this end? So she has no comment on the green bottle part of the mural. Alright, I'm satisfied. There's nothing I can do in this room. My current items. Wait, what if I turn a light off in this room? Like, maybe I want to light... Ah, oh, I can't even use the switch. Where's the light even coming from? I was thinking maybe if I turn the electrical light off and lit the candle. You want to sit down for a second? Get some energy back? Alright, mural room we can rest in. I'll remember that. Good to know. Alright, the room right next to here, there may be something to find. I feel like I haven't fully found everything in this other room here. Ah, I mean, that's the bird. I technically meant this room, but I, the bird as well. There's something I'll do with the bird. Who knows what it is. All right, this light switch doesn't work, right? Which is broken. Stretch? Thanks, Doobie. I will. Uh. Good stretch. Good stretch. Need that. Nothing else here. Dot, dot, dot. It's some broken tableware. Like, she jumped over and looked at this inside this box, but it seems like she didn't grab anything. Like, why did I even go over there? Or is that where I got the robe? Maybe she did grab something. I think I'm misremembering. Yeah, that might be where I got the robe. I was thinking I didn't get anything in there. All right. Oh, man, it is way too early to give up and look it up. I don't want to look it up. Got to figure this out. Looks like a bird's nest. Let's throw a rock at it. Nope. 
Use the robe on it to capture the bird. Rope. Okay, none of my current items do anything with it. Um, grab the stick, poke it, and then the bird flies around. But what is step three? Step one, look at bird. Step two, poke bird nest. Step three, black robe bird. No. And I've tried the rock. Tried the rope. And as far as I know, there is no system for combining items in this game. So I can't, like, make a fling mm, out of the, like, robe and rock, for example. It looks like a bird's nest. We're all aware that's what it looks like. Um... Yeah, and then she doesn't do anything with the box, except say there's nothing in it. I guess I gotta get rid of the bird before I push the box over. Okay, I can't figure out anything to do in this room. What was this room again? I know I was just in here, but I forgot which room this is. Is this the kitchen? Storage room. Okay. There's not a room. No, there's no more further to the left that I missed. Okay, well, I can't seem to do anything up here. Let's go back downstairs. We'll go back outside to the pool area. Point and click game played with a controller. The game works surprisingly well. It's actually not uncomfortable to play at all. It is definitely slow paced, but it doesn't bother me. Okay, let's go back outside. Must have missed something out there. I must have, because, geez, what the heck am I missing? Nothing out there. There's a courtyard outside. I don't think there's anything further to the right, but let's... Oh, wait, maybe there was a door over here. Let's check, because that's the door that leads outside. Anything over here? It seems that the door's locked. All that just for a locked door. Okay. Go outside. Very high probability I missed something out here. I don't think I found anything here. Though I think this is basically just a hallway. Outdoors. Alright, while we're here, we gotta go back in the jail room. Hmm. Very little that's interactable in this room. Can I go 
go back in the cell? Doesn't look like it. He doesn't want to talk anymore. He's no longer looking at Jennifer. Well, have I tried the rope on him? Maybe we can hang him. How about an old-fashioned lynching? Nope. Black robe? No, oh, he's not looking at me. Doesn't look like there's anything else I can interact with. What in the world am I missing? I feel like there should be something with this pool, but there doesn't seem to be. Hmm, nothing, nothing. And do I hate to say it, but we might be on checking a guide already. Unless anyone in chat has any ideas on what I could try. I'm out of things to even try. We have used every item on every interactable object that I can find. Like, I must be missing something. Like, there's a room you can go into that I've just walked past over and over and I just don't see the room. I don't know. This is just a locked door over here. Probably tried the rock already. Let's try it again. I don't think there's anything up here except the broken... broken uh, walkway that I can't cross. Hmm. I can't interact with the broken walkway that I can see. Maybe I'm missing a little interaction bar somewhere. You still stuck? Yeah, Pat Mario, I got no clue. I've, I've walked back and forth through the entire mansion like twice, maybe three times. I feel like I've tried every item in every spot. I might, I hate it, but I might have to go to a guide. I got no clue. Yeah, there's nothing I can interact with up here.
Hmm. Only we had like an expert in this game in chat that could kind of point us in the right direction without majorly spoiling anything. Just when I get real stuck. That Mario, what do I do? You're on guide duty. Tell me what to do. Maybe I'm supposed to be turning the lights off. I have all the lights on. Looking for the answer. Like it, oh, maybe I go look here. It's possible it's like, oh, things are happen differently if the lights are off versus on. And I'm just leaving all the lights on. It's just, I'm pretty sure this is the bathroom. No, maybe one of these two rooms. I didn't, I don't think I ever found anything in this room. Maybe I smashed this table with a rock. Oh. A comfortable sofa. Turning you off, TV. That took a while. Maybe I use the rope on this painting or this empty box. Put the rope in the box. Um, put the rock in the box. Nope, she just constantly, I mean, did you cr move the crate next to the bird puzzle? It wouldn't let me move it, unless there's something I didn't understand. Whenever I interact with that crate, it just says it's empty. It doesn't move it. Do I have to do something specific to move that crate? Because I tried that, but I, it, it doesn't move it. I'll show you. I'll head there now. Because I thought the same thing. Like, obviously, I'm supposed to push this crate over by the bird. Do I need a special item to move it or something? I don't know, but you see something in the guide about moving moving the crate next to the bird? You just saw it on Reddit. Well, hey, Maybe, like, the way to start driving the car in that one ending I got was kind of weird. It could just be some of the controls are wacky in this game, and I was supposed to... The thing is, I moved a different crate, and I moved that crate just by clicking on it. But when I click on this crate, she just says, there's nothing in it, or it's empty, or something like that. But we'll head back there. We're almost there.
How do you go from murderer puppet to this? Because this is what chat voted for. The Clock Tower series. Oh wait, not that's the wrong door. If I run, I run out of energy, and then if I run into the scissor man, he'll kill me. I need to be I need to save my energy for when someone's trying to murder me. Okay, here's the crate. If I interact with the crate, nothing is inside. That's her reaction. Maybe I put a rock inside, no. Put a rope inside, no. Put a rope inside. Sorry, someone already made the rock beat scissor joke. They beat you to it. Nothing is inside. Wee, and then she just jumps over it. Looks like a bird nest. Oh! Oh, you kidding me? All right, see you, Rockus. Uh, so, you have to do this in a very specific order. I have to look at the nest, say it looks like a bird's nest, and then get move the box, because if I go straight to the stick to hit the next nest, after that, she won't move the box. All right, so it's just a weird ordering thing. Thank you, you saved the day, Fat Mario. What is this? The nest is full of eggs and junk. There's a key in here. He is inside the nest. Pocketed the West Wing key. Bat Mario, you're a legend. They're going to sing songs about you for centuries for this. Did you check the left bed to evade? No, I have not. That sounds like a spoiler. I haven't been I haven't had Scissor Man chasing me in the room with two beds. But now we're good. Now we don't need a guide for a while. If we get stuck again, we can check a guide again. That doesn't really feel like cheating too much because I tried to move that crate like four times. And it seemed like I couldn't. There's multiple endings, so I don't know which one I should do. Oh, it's all good. Um, I already got one ending. I got ending... G? I think it was. I literally just hopped in the car and left. <laughs> that was one of the endings. I left all the girls here, but then apparently I was murdered back at the orphanage. So depending on how much I like, I think this game's really short. Um, is my understanding. So I might get all the endings depending on how long that takes. And since you seem to be able to just continue from right before you got an ending, I'll likely get every ending. All right, I got the West Wing. Wait a minute. Oh, I bet I was supposed to use this key upstairs. We're going back upstairs again. This is so exciting, a new key. And we learned something helpful with the order in which you do things is very, very important in this game. So double whammy. We're less likely to get stuck now that we know that. Oh, it was this door. I'm so glad I didn't keep going. Ooh, a new area. Scary. We don't know what we're gonna see here. Ooh. 
Let's go left first. This is a very purple hallway. Stairs. We'll wait to go downstairs. Or. What do we got here? Oh my, okay. What was that sound? Really? Why did you do that, Jennifer? Ew! We don't like that. We would like that not to happen again. What's going on over here? We got... Oh, come on. You tell me I can't interact with any of this. I don't believe you. Really? These look like I should... should... Ah, there we are. Um, nothing? Why did you turn yellow from that? That upset you to open? Open it again. Well, I don't understand what's happening there, but she's apparently upset by what she sees in there. Supposed to use an item on that? Tie it up. Oh, she's just gonna do the same thing again. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know why she opens that and then does nothing with it. Maybe I can hide in there if I get chased. That's a hiding spot, maybe. I hope that's what it is. Can I sit down and relax in here, or is this room too spooky? Room might be too spooky. Alright, before I go downstairs, let's keep exploring upstairs. Let's explore the other side. What is this? This is Clock Tower, Frenchie. The original Clock Tower was a Japan-only horror game for the Super Famicom, but this is the English translation of it. There's, I believe, four games in the Clock Tower series, and uh, my plan for October is to play through all four of them. Uh, the others are all more, a little more modern. I think two and three are on the PlayStation. Or wait, the second and third, I should say, are on the PlayStation, and then the fourth, which is actually called Clock Tower 3, is on the PS2. I believe. But I'm no expert. I'm, I'm playing totally blind. I've never played this before, or at all. Ooh. Spooky, turn the lights on. The switch is broken. What's the TLLDR? I don't know anything. Never mind. Okay. Because I could give you a rundown. The author's name is Faded. That's a weird name. Okay, rundown, please. Uh, my name is Jennifer. I am one of four orphan girls whose age is not mentioned, but honestly, you know, they don't seem like little kids. They all seem about Jennifer's age. I'm guessing we're roughly like 14, 15 year old orphans. Uh, our a maternity magazine. Let me pause it while I give you the rundown. We were brought, we were all adopted at the same time by some rich family that we had never met. Uh, some sort of, 
I don't know, lady that worked at the orphanage named Miss Mary brought us here where we were all four of us girls were going to be living now. That's how the game started. Uh, and then almost immediately, Miss Mary disappeared. And when I went to go find her, the other three girls I was with also disappeared. And a crazy tiny man with a giant pair of scissors is now trying to kill me. I found at least one of my fellow orphan girls murdered already. I believe at least more than one has been murdered, but I'm not 100% sure. And Miss Mary's evil. She kidnapped, she drugged me and put me in a prison cell I had to escape from. And we don't know much more than that. So I'm trying to find the other girls I showed up with and not be murdered by the crazy scissor man or Miss Mary. And we're exploring this creepy mansion now. Oh, and the guy who supposedly adopted us was in the prison cell with me, starving to death. So the whole thing was a lie, apparently. I think that's the whole story you've missed. But it's been pretty interesting. It's been pretty fun. Crevice looks pretty deep. There's something shiny in there. Usually something shiny is a key. Rope? No. Rock? No. I don't see how a robe will help, but try it. Okay, no, we gotta find something to get that out of there. Like a big stick or something, maybe. Um, Into that crevice. Alright. We'll remember that. We'll remember there's a key in the library. Which is in the West Wing's second floor. This room looks a little messed up. It feels like someone's watching. Oh no, that's bad. Twitch is broken. Who's watching? Don't be scissor man. It's a big clown doll. This is a French doll. Oh, it's a Frenchie doll hung from the ceiling. It's a Frenchie doll. Oh, a fire. Okay. This room doesn't look so bad. It looks like a nice room. Still no light. We'll appreciate a nice fire. I wonder who lit this. This might be a good room to rest and try to get back to blue. Can I rest here by the fire? Find out. I can, yes. Oh, we got blue nice and fast. Let's let her sit for a second. All right. A portrait of a middle-aged woman. It's a picture of a woman. This person looks familiar. Me. We got here. Let's dig through their garbage. Empty. Books. Some books. This desk is dusty. There's a pool in the courtyard. I know. We've been there. Written here looks serious. Okay, so that's next to the weird torn up nursery. And there's a library ish thing, or like a study, I suppose. We got in here. Oh. 
another pile of crap room? What's going on with this pile? Can I interact with it anywhere? No? What am I missing? Am I missing something? Seems like there's nothing interactable in this room. That's a first. Okay. Oh. We just can't even walk further than that? Odd. That room's a dead end. I wonder if that's just a trap for Scissor Man to get us. Like, definitely don't go in that room if you're running from Scissor Man. A board! We want this. We want this to cross um, where the floor fell out. We've been looking for a board just like... Is that where I am? Am I next to that? Yeah, maybe? It's a simple plank of wood. Well, yeah, use it here. First floor can be seen. Use the plank of wood. Yeah. Wee. Ooh, hello. That's a nice little statue. She has nothing to say. Now, what the heck is going on here? The wall looks painted over. Yes, it does. Can we use a rock on it? No, can't smash it. Okay. Um, what is this at the foot of the statue? There's something there. It's not on the other statue. Hmm. Oh, you know, some valuable looking pictures. No, what's going on? Don't be scissor man. Oh, it's scissor man. Run. No! We don't like scissor, man. Wait, wait, go down the stairs, actually. Wait, I haven't gone been here before. I don't know what's down here. This might be a mistake. Hopefully, I can hide in here. A bathroom. He'll never look here. I, can I can I hide anywhere in here? Hello? Really? I can't. Can I even get behind the curtain? Can I do anything? Oh, we'll bail on this stupid room. This room sucks. Run! Um, anywhere to hide? Anywhere to hide? Find the curtain? Somewhere? Ah! No! What do I do? What do I do? Use the rock! Rock him! Use the rock! No! Uh, uh. No! Ah. Alright, where do I lose that little pipsqueak?
Where does it pick me up when I continue? Is he still chasing me? Oh, crap. I should have left faster. Ah, I'm just gonna die again, aren't I? Can I just like run past him maybe? He's doing a little dance. Okay, you can't run past him. I was hoping I could. Okay, so you can fight him off, but you need somewhere to go when you do. You can't run past him, which is what I was hoping I could do. Okay, let's continue again and try immediately turning around and leaving this dumb room. Like, this was a mistake. Okay. Keep running. This is where it ends? That's not good. Go this way. Oh, great. Another dead end. Where the heck do I go to lose this guy? Music changed. This room does not look safe. Corpse of a crow. There's a key here. Pocketed the cage key. Interesting. Interesting. Single birds left in the cage. Rats scurry about in there. Got something called a cage key. Do I not let the bird out? Like, is it not for this cage? Maybe it's the cage, um... That guy's trapped in. The owner of the house. So I lost him? I just had to run around for a while? Anticlimactic. Seems that the door's locked. What the heck? I can't interact with this door. What's so special about this door? What? Never had a door I couldn't interact with. Funny. store I can. Wait, I think I know where I am. I know where I am. All right, let's see if the cage key goes to this cage. I don't know where else the cage key would go. If it's not this, it's somewhere I don't think I've been yet. Yo, I got a cage key. What do you think of that, dude? Better not try to eat me again.
He's no longer. I can't. I thought maybe I'd entice him with the key, but no, he, uh, I don't seem to be able to interact with the door. So I guess this is not where the cage key is used. Okay. I don't know where it's used then. Maybe I haven't found the room yet. I should probably head back to where he popped out of that box and tried to kill me because I'd never searched that room. Still, uh, Scissor Man is freaky. He freaks me out, but he's uh, pretty easy to get away from, honestly. I never even found a hiding spot. I just ran around for a while until he wasn't chasing me anymore. All right, let's head. Have I been all the way over here yet? I don't think I have. Let's keep exploring this way before we turn around. Okay, stairs. So that should lead back up to that room with like the weird meat jars. If I'm not mistaken. But I haven't been in here yet. What the? Those mannequins? Oh, uh, I don't like the look of this. Let's go take a look at this mannequin. This mannequin is wearing... What the? Oh, its head fell off. This mannequin is wearing a dress. Looks nice. We're just knocking them all over. Anything else there? No? Yeah, there's a, I can interact with. That can't be it. There has to be more to this room than that. Oh, what the? That was pretty creepy. You? If you want some rock? I got a rock. Use the rock on her. All right, we're leaving. All right, back upstairs. We're gonna go check the room where Scissor Man tried to kill us. Actually, wasn't the fireplace room nearby? Uh, we can heal back up to blue sanity in that room. I don't think it's this one. I think it might be... No, wait, that's where I originally came from. I think that's the torn up nursery, I think. Still don't really know this side of the house. And so I think the next one is the room with the fire that I can heal in. I was wrong, but it's the next room, so that's cool.
Yes. Let's go sit by the fire. Have a nice sit. This room feels safe. Nice toasty fire. There we are, we're back to blue. We're feeling good. All right. We should be coming up on where I had to plop down that, uh, Link. This room was the trap. Glad I didn't forget about that. I wonder if I could have stopped and removed that plank. Um... Can I interact with the plank anymore? No, I cannot. Hopefully he's not still there. I assume he won't. He didn't go back to hiding in that random box again. Maybe he lives in that box. That would be unfortunate. I could never search that room. Okay, this was the room where he tried to kill me. Now we can search it. Um, check over here. Oh, what do we have here? Okay. What was the box he was in? Can't even search it. What if we hit it with this stick? Go whack that wall with the stick. Nice! She actually did exactly what I said. Good job, Jennifer. That's how you get things done. You just start smashing walls. There's a room over there. Whoa, that's a weird room. It hasn't been used in ages. The air in this room is stagnant. Uh, let's get the light on. If it even has power, I can't. Can I interact with anything? This like there's stuff written on the wall, isn't there? I can't interact with it. Maybe I need a light on, or I need some sort of light. Maybe it's too dark. I don't know. Let's go check this door. Why won't you go through that door? What is going on? Why can't... There's like nothing in this room. I can't interact with anything. Except to leave again. Why did I even bother smashing it open, huh? Doesn't seem right. Let's leave and come back. Did I ever try to light in this room? I 
the problem is it's too dark. I wish she would say that. So I would know, like, oh, I need to come back with a candle or something. Alright, let's try one more time. Make sure it wasn't just like a glitch or something. Run. Ooh. Nope, she just doesn't do anything when she gets to the end there. She doesn't go through that door. Doesn't say it's locked. She doesn't even try. Room is nothing. If I find a candle or something, I'm coming back. I'm guessing the implication is she can't see. But I don't know. All right, have I been further to the right? Oh, maybe there is no further to the right. Nope, there isn't any. All right, downstairs there were some rooms I didn't really explore because he was trying to kill me, like a bathroom and stuff. We can go check those out now that we're not being chased. You gotten any further? I mean, I've been exploring. That that key opened up a wide new area. Scissor Man tried to kill me. And uh we're just exploring a bit now. We haven't really explored every room fully yet. We found a new key called the H key. I don't know where to use it yet. Oh no. That's Scissor Man. Go! Oh jeez. You kidding me, game? No, don't leave. It wasn't Scissor Man. <laughs> he tricked me. Okay, go back in. All right, check this sink out. I don't know. Look around. The water is running. Oh, good. All right, once again, it doesn't seem like there's anything to interact with. I don't know if I'm missing something in these rooms. There's like a lot of rooms with literally nothing to interact with. I don't really know what their purpose is. Maybe they're just somewhere to try to hide from Scissor Man. Oh, now I can interact. There we are. I thought there might be a spot. Take a quick shower. This is stressful. Gotta get clean. I've been all sweaty. Looks like the shower is working. Oh, okay. I assume maybe I can hide in there. I don't know. Either way, it doesn't seem to be anything to find in here. Ah, yes, I haven't really explored the piano room. I died in here a couple times. The record player. It's unplugged. All kinds of music here. Oh, 
no! You kidding me? <laughs> I should not have played the piano. Granted, what was she thinking in the first place? Why did you do that? That was clearly a very bad idea. That is her playing the piano. Still. All right, let's try to hide in that shower curtain, see if we can. Worth a shot, right? Can't interact with it now? Well, I guess I can't hide in there. They can't even interact with it anymore. I could before. I don't fully, I don't really understand the rules of escaping the Scissor Man sometimes in this game. Either way, I think I know a place to go. Here, let's go up these stairs. Oh, oh upstairs. There we are. I think if I run to the meat, the meat jar room, I can maybe try hiding in that filing, not filing cabinet thing, that weird closet thing in the back. Can't take this with me, can I? Run! hurt myself oh I'm almost red never got this low this place I'm trying to run to is too far I'm almost there I think hope I remembered right I think it's this room I did remember right. Array for the meat jars. Hide in this thing. No, don't tell me you can't interact with it. No way. I thought that was for hiding in. Well, I'm dead. I'm super duper dead. Lasso him. Use the rope. Yeah, there's nothing to do here. Die. I fight him off, I fall down, and he does a little dance, which is kind of fun. Oh, he fell! Run! It worked! He didn't dance his jig this time. Seriously, though, where do I go? How do I get away from him? Same place I got away from him last time. Can I just do the same thing again? Does that work? I think I got away from him over here, didn't I? Not this room. Next room. Why didn't... I... No, don't go in this room. It's not the room I want. Go back out. I'm in the next one. That room. Technically this room. Yeah, just go over here, girl. room in the same spot again. Jeez, that was a long chase. I need to find somewhere with some light and uh, sit and get my health back. I 
guess I could go back to the fireplace room again. Shut up, phone. I know you won't really let me answer. That phone is a liar. Hmm. Still, that guy's not that hard to escape. All of my other orphan friends must suck if they all got caught so easily. That's probably why they were orphans. Their parents were disappointed in their inability to run away. Should be able to heal up in this next. Go sit next to my favorite fire. All right, we need a long sit here need to go get a drink or something now's the time it's gonna be like two three minutes before I can do anything See yellow. There we are. Give me blue. There we are. Now we're blue. We are pretty. Okay, let's go. All right, where 
Oh, I was downstairs. It was downstairs that he attacked me. In the piano room. Go back there. I think that might be this next room. I think it's this room. Ah, piano room. All right. I use that tile that fell. Like part of the ceiling fell. Can't use it. Can I play the piano again? Because that was a bad idea last time. Can't believe she actually did it again. You were very close to being murdered last time you did that. Only junk inside. Painting. Nothing. Oh. A staff rests in this pot. I picked up a staff. Oh, I could use that to reach into that hole. There was a key. Oh, cool. We did find something useful. We're going to get another key out of that. And maybe it'll be used for more than just that, but that's a good start. Making progress. Now, where was that? That was upstairs where there was that hole. to the left, I'm pretty sure. Wasn't, it maybe was here. I think this was the trap. I don't think it was in here, but we'll double check. No, it was not here. Maybe it was this one? I think it was this one. No, okay. Uh, I don't think it was a creepy nursery, but I'll double check. It was It was like a library. I, I think it was right before the nursery, actually. I think it's next door down. Although maybe I can do something in here? I think so, though. Child's bed is dirty with stains and dust. You don't think it's an adult's bed? A key was left on it. Oh, another key. I almost missed that one. I'm glad I came back through here. Oh, no. What are you doing, you creepy doll?
What? They're gonna hurt me. Please don't kill me, doll. Did I run? Run! I feel like I should run. Yeah, let's run. The door will not open. Woo! Bad doll. Thank you for the key, though. Wait, no, no. Go back this way. Go by the fire again. Okay, we got two keys. And I think I'm on my way to get another key. Think about it, I'm on my way to get a third key. We're getting tons of keys. We'll have this whole mansion unlocked soon enough. All right, we gotta sit down though. We're getting attacked by a doll. Gotta take a little sit. All blue, baby. All right, let's go get the other thing and then figure out where these keys go. There wasn't much locked on this side of the mansion. Um, I think I got keys to probably go to the other side of the mansion. Was that key labeled the one I just got? Wait, where, oh, it doesn't even show up in here. Okay. All right, so I think I need to go two doors down to use the staff, hopefully, to get the items inside the hole in the wall. I think this room. Yes, yes, yes. All right, I think I want to use the staff here. Let's find out. Crevice looks pretty deep. There's something shiny in there. Can't reach in with the staff? Oh, I really thought that's what we'd use the staff for. Dang, okay. Well, we don't know how to get that yet then. We'll come back. So what's the staff for? Maybe I use it with the robe. Maybe the staff and the robe are disguised when put together. Be like a creepy cultist or something. Also, I just realized that cage key is an item, whereas other keys are not items. You just have a key. Uh, it must, maybe it's used on one of the cages that was literally in the room where I found the cage key. I should probably go try to use it there. There was one that had a single bird and one that had a bunch of rats. Probably, maybe I want to let the bird out. I doubt it would be good for me to let a whole lot of rats out. go take a look but i don't know what letting the bird out would do like maybe one of the cages has a key in it or some sort of usable item go check the cage room that's it no okay this leads back to the other side good to know
Where's the cage room? I know it's close. I bet it's the next room. Uh, oh, this is the door that I can't interact with for whatever reason, which feels wrong. Doesn't feel right. Why can't every other door in the entire game is interactable? This one she just ignores. What's up with that? What am I missing? You lost in CK3? Oh, I didn't even realize you were playing. What were you doing? Woo! Didn't see this room before. This room looks like the one in the mural. Oh! Oh, it does. Oh, that's probably not good. So this was like on fire, right? There was fire above the green jar. It's a celadon vase. Okay. So I likely need to find items to make this room match. The ceremony thing? Strange symbols are written here. Time will cause adherence. What does that mean? I turned into a woman because my male heir died, but my heir isn't a part of my house. Oh, absolutely brutal. Neck severed on a crow's corpse. A square hole is visible. The cradle under the star. There's something underneath here. Um, staff? No. So obviously, I need something squared to stick in the hole. Um, I mean, I don't think I may not have whatever it is. HP? No. I don't care about the square hole under the star. Uh,. Stop talking. All right, sometimes you gotta do things in a certain order. Uh, I'm where cars are here. What does that mean? I'll mess with the jar again. I don't care if it's a cell on a base. What is that? Alright. Well, I don't think I have whatever I need for this room at the moment. I need something that I could stick in a square hole. We'll keep an eye out. I don't know how I missed that room before when I went through this hallway. All right, is this the cage room? I'm missing the cage room. Cage room, okay. I don't think the lights work. Let's try it just in case. Oh, it's white. Oh, oh my. Some hanging crow corpses. They've been decapitated. So one of these is rats. Rats scurry about in here, and the other is a bird. A single bird's left in the cage. So I think I choose. I can open one of these cages. It seems like you'd want to open a single bird, right? Not a bunch of rats. Better let the bird out and see what happens. I hope I find a way out of here, too. You're welcome, bird. Can I check your cage now? Is there anything to find in there? Empty. Well, whatever. Let's let the rats out. Hopefully they don't eat us. The rats ran away? Oh, okay. Okay. Where would rats run to? Maybe they went to that um, hole? That, uh... I can't figure out how to, what to do in there. Wow. 
library room. All right, clearly we'll see those rats again. I think the whole reason I wanted to go, I was in there was to get the rats out. So I think the rats will do something that benefits me. I have a feeling. Nothing in this room. Dead end. There's a couple, two rooms I want to check now that I released the rats. Three rooms I want to check now that I released the rats. One is that room that I opened up by breaking the wall down, just in case, right over here. Then the library, then the meat jar. Those are the three spots I want to check. Maybe I can use the staff to bust down that obvious fake wall upstairs. I should try that too. Wait, this is the bathroom, isn't it? I don't care about the bathroom. Yeah, we don't care about the bathroom. I have nothing in here. All right, is this the room I want? It might be. Well, connected to this room. No, this is the piano room. It's definitely not the room I want. Oh wait, was it upstairs? I think the room I want is upstairs, not downstairs. I think this is the last room. Yeah. We want to go upstairs. All three rooms I want to check are upstairs. Over here. First, let's try beating up this wall with the staff we found, just in case. Hitting walls with large sticks so far has worked out well for us in this game. Ah, oh, that's not the solution. Darn. I don't know what the rats could have possibly done over here, but I'm hoping they did something. Because what the heck, I literally break an entire door down and, and there's nothing to do in there? Or break a wall down? Gotta be something in there. Still nothing to interact with, just Eve. So annoying, whatever. Okay, we have two other rooms that we want to check. Let's go. And neither of them work. We have an entire key that we don't know what door it opens yet. I'm assuming it's a door somewhere in the first half of uh, this mansion. We can go check all the doors that were locked over there, which really is only a couple.
This is the fireplace room. That is the nursery with the doll that tried to kill us. That's the room I want. Hoping the rats are in here or did something in here. I don't know how they would have got in there. I'm not hearing any rat noises. That's not a good sign. Yeah, I'm thinking the rats are not here. Yep. How do I get that shiny thing? I want it. So I noticed I kept the cage key. Does it just keep every item? I already used that. I don't know if that means it'll have another use or if just you keep every item in this game. Alright, last room to check is the meat, the meat jar room because I'm thinking maybe the meat jar on the floor would have attracted the rats. Maybe they did something in there. If that's not the case, I got no clue. Here's the meat jar room. No rats? I thought the rats would be in here. Huh. What the heck that sound? Okay, I don't... Let's go check this weird thing at the end of the room again, because I still have no idea what it is. Use, I don't know, use staff on it? Just opens it and looks at it and leaves and says nothing. What am I supposed to do with that? Oh! She wasn't in there before. Oh my goodness. There's a dead person in there. Well, that's something new. All right, I am enjoying this game, but I think I'm gonna end the stream for today. I'm gonna be back on Clock Tower tomorrow, uh, where I don't know if I'll beat it. I could see this potentially being a three-day stream game. Uh, I'm gonna, don't know how saving works in this game. I don't know if I just quit, if it like auto-saved at some point, and I don't know how to save. Uh, so I'm going to just use a save state for this. I don't believe in save states for save scumming. But I will use it to end my stream for the day so I can pick off up exactly where I left off. Uh, thanks for watching, everybody. I've been having a lot of fun with this. I will definitely be playing more of it and then probably the rest of the Clock Tower series. Hopefully I will see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Have a good one. Pat Mario, sorry you lost CK3. Better luck next time. Thank you.